Rackham Tarot, um, based on author Rackham's um, paintings and such. <laughs> and again, this I've been lately I've been getting a lot of the Los Gabriel decks, and yeah, with the Radiant Wise Spirit deck that I just did the video on, it didn't have like six languages along the border. It was just standard type of version of the weight deck, but it's good. <laughs> uh, okay, so when you open it, you get your usual little black and white pamphlet. So, um, in the late 19th century, book and magazine artists reached a zenith of brilliance that has become known as the golden age of illustration. The artists include uh, Walter Crane, Edmund Dulloch, Aubrey Beardsley, Kay Nielsen, and perhaps the greatest of them all, Arthur Rackham. Born in London 1867, he confirmed his calling when he illustrated a popular edition of Grimm's Fairy Tales, followed shortly after The Legend of Sleepy Hollow and Peter Pan in Kingston Gardens. So, continues on. Some famous works include Alice in Wonderland, Midsummer's Night Dream. So, So you got like pen and ink and watercolor um, type of workings. And so you get your cover card and with the backing. So, and again, this is one where if you do upright and reversals, you don't know if it's an upright or reversal until you flip the card. And then you get the usual Luis Gabriel information card. So, you don't get the name, like, you don't get Zero the Fool, you get Zero Zero. You get two, two. And, like, you get simple type of illustrations like this and then you get stuff like this my camera is deciding not to really focus in other than my face oh yeah this is Lovely. Uh, isn't this like Wind in the Willows type of characters? Or... Of course, not focusing. But... <laughs> But you get like these dark kind of images with these lighter type of images. Just like really, and then like for like three of cups, you got the cups there and then the number there. And for like the court cards, you get the symbol of like who they are, like the page or knight, along with the image of the suit.
So you get like a mix of like sweet type of images with the not so sweet type of things. So like playful and like serious kind of scenes. So Like, it's just really interesting and different step out of what I usually would get. But it's not totally out where I'm like, oh, why did I purchase this? So, it's still in the same kind of area that I like. But, I'm not totally off by a... There's a chance I'll likely use this sometime <laughs> for readings. So, yeah. So, it's nice, like, so if you like artists, like, tarot decks that have been taken or inspired by, like, using artists, painters, whatever, creative images, and them saying, oh, this really looks like the fool, or this really looks like the magician, or whatever, and having them do that, and... Yeah, um, the Rackham Tarot can be one for you. So, yeah, happy readings.